So hi dear Virgo, a very very good evening to you guys. This is Anjali Tarot and this is a general reading for all the Virgo Sun Moon Venus rising. Keep in mind this is general. It might or might not resonate with you at the first place. The second thing, the rules can be reversed also. Third thing, this is a reading from 18 till the 24th of November and it's valid for every 12 sign that you are dealing with along with your own sign. If it is not resonating, it's not your story. You can just uh, uh, skip the video. <laughs> if you want to be a professional tarot card reader like me, you can start your journey by purchasing my course. The link is in the description box for the same. If you want to start your self-healing journey with hope, oh, no, oh, no, but don't know from where to start, you can definitely start by purchasing my masterclass. Again, the link is in the description box for the same and it has the power to change your life for the rest of your life. Trust me on that, I'm doing it from a very, very long time now. And if you want a one-on-one -on -one healing sessions or personal readings, you can check out the description box and you can mail me for the same. So let's start, Virgo. Your person or your partner's current feelings for you right now at this present moment are, let's see what's happening. We have the tower in reverse. So the towers in the upright position or the towers in reverse doesn't make any like much of a difference because it's tower anyway. So this is somebody who is uh, in shock, in surprise because of whatever happened. But now they have accepted to some extent like the disaster, whatever disaster happened between you guys. Okay, because it's in reverse. Let me clarify the tower in reverse for you guys as the feelings for you. <coughs> We have the King of Wands, the Knight of Swords, the Six of Swords. They got to know this person is feeling like uh, uh, cheated. This person is feeling cheated by you. This person is feeling like cheated by the circumstances in the situation. Because either even uh, if they were the one who were dealing with two people, two situations, two energies at the same time, they are feeling betrayed in the situation. They are feeling like uh, shocked in the situation. They are feeling like why the hell everything, everything fell apart and... Uh, uh, universe is so unkind to them. Universe is so uh, impossible to deal with them. Wow. So this person is trying their best to move on from the situation towards karma, water, finding their balance, finding their peace. Now, e like either they cheated on you or you cheated on them, but there is some kind of cheating involved in the situation where other people, other energy was also involved in the mix and uh, somebody got to know about that. So, but they are trying their best to make peace with whatever happened. Let's see what do you feel about this particular person or situation from your side. So it's like their energies are still in this energy of I should go towards Virgo, I should rush towards Virgo, I should charge on them, I should talk, talk to them, I should uh, get the answers but they're trying to make peace with whatever happened. Let's see what do you feel about this particular person or situation from your side Virgo. Ten of Wands, it's too stressful for you to deal with this situation so you're trying to drop it. I'm saying trying to drop it because you're not dropping it properly. Let me clarify the ten of wands as your feelings for this particular person or situation. We have the page of pentacles, the page of cups and the strength card. Yes, yes, you're still protecting. You're still trying to uh, stay in connection, stay in touch with this person, even if it is just as a friend. You know, and you're holding on to this connection for dear life. You're like, this connection, this person, this situation means a lot to me. I can't just let this go, uh, let go of this situation or this person this much easily. I have to do something about it. So it's basically a stressful situation where you are trying to drop it, but at the same time, you're not able to drop it. It's taking you a lot of courage and strength to let it go completely. <clears throat> yeah, you feel like saving this connection. And, and never letting this go, even if even if it means that you guys are never going to be in a relationship again. That's quite important for you. Let's see what this person wants from you. What are their intentions for the situation between you and the Virgo? Eight of Pentacles. Okay. They want to put in the effort and energy in the right direction. Now, in the right direction with the right kind of energies, right kind of circumstances. Let me clarify this. Eight of Pentacles. Wow, they might be using some kind of spell work or something and using their moon cycle, moon cycle as well to get something done in the situation. We have the five of cups, the chariot and the seven of cups, seven of wands. <coughs> Virgo, this person definitely want you to go through the same kind of pain that you gave them. This person wants to block your way. They don't want you to move on from this particular, per particular situation. They want you to get stuck on this situation forever because they are so upset with whatever happened they can't just let you go so easily wow 
this person wants to block your path of moving on from them permanently they want you to be as upset as they are wow this is see according to them they are doing the justice by manifesting this kind of energy for you because they are so hurt even if they are the one who messed up here they don't want you to move on from them this person doesn't want you as a lover or they don't want a commitment or relationship or marriage or something like that with you no they just want you to suffer the way they are suffering or they suffered because of this situation at some point of time let's see what do you want from this particular person or situation from your side virgo sun card all you want to be clear and happy in your life all you want is clarity everything should be crystal clear as a sunny day in front of you let me clarify the sun for you guys as your intentions okay we have the 6 of wands in reverse ace of pentacles and the 4 of wands see you no longer want somebody else to decide for you you want to have something stable on the table uh, some kind of commitment some kind of long term partnership some kind of marriage kind of a deal you want something that is going to work out for you for the longest period of your period of time and something stable right you don't want to deal with anything or anyone who is providing you this kind of on off or on and off in and out we are together we are not together kind of energies you want clarity you want happiness and all you want is something stable on the table that's going to last long if not for the rest of your life for the longest period of your time you can say of your life let's see what's coming towards you till the 24th of november virgo page of cups some kind of message communication emotional message communication or some kind of apology might be coming towards you let me clarify the page of cups we have the knight of pentacles the seven of swords the eight of swords so somebody is going to tell you about the betrayal about the behind the behind the scenes kind of the story it's like somebody can't sleep at night without thinking negative about the situation without thinking negative about this whole dynamic so somebody is preparing themselves to open their mouth to you to open themselves emotionally to you and tell you the truth regarding whatever they were trying to hide from you regarding whatever blocked kind of energies that you were feeling in the situation so somebody is planning to come with the truth okay or and or they will get to know something about you and they will try to clarify the air with you clear the air with you clarify the air. clear the air with you in some way so if they have blocked you they are going to unblock you and then they are going to talk to you they are not going to talk to you immediately they are going to uh, take their time to uh, unblock you and then connect with you and then talk to you emotional message communication and or some kind of apology but basically this person wants to clear the air with you regarding some kind of betrayal that either you did with them or they did with you okay because they are feeling blocked in the situation until unless they are not going to clear the air with you properly and honestly right cool let's see the guidance for you guys virgo <clears throat> knight of pentacles in reverse and the ace of swords and the seven of cups you have to move on quickly from the situation you can't get yourself stuck in the situation forever okay because according to the cards you have given enough time enough energy enough resources to the situation already you have already wasted so much of your time and energy on the situation now it's the time for you to get the mental clarity and get out of this confusion get out of this hellish kind of energy that you are still giving your time and resources to it's high time for you to realize that you have to let this go sooner or later so it's better to go it let it go as soon as possible and walk through the path with courage and with strength you can't just skip the part of moving on to the next chapter without any kind of pain or without any kind of lessons on the way you can't just skip it nobody can so the sooner the better right so yeah thank you so much for tuning in virgo i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you Namaste.